So when I was first uh, suspended for something that I, I, I was later acquitted of, during that suspension I, I hit a downward spiral um, of depression, anxiety. Um, I, 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 it got so bad that I made a point to command uh, Richard Hedges specifically. I, I made him aware of how hard it was on me. There were times that I couldn't even get out of bed and the service being aware of all of this, they just make matters worse by, you know, showing up at my house to verify that I wasn't lying or, you know, um, I show up seven minutes late for signing because my goal train was late and they charged me with insubordination. The Toronto police never, ever, once helped me in any of my low stages. Having gone through all this with zero support from the service, it, it got so bad with the pushing um, of, you know, investigations on me, trying to lay more charges on me, that it actually drove me to thinking about suicide all the time. If I was awake, I'd be thinking about suicide, thinking about ways to do it, thinking about where to do it, best time to do it, things like that. When I was awake, that's what I thought about. And it, it, that, those demons forced me into a, a, another spiral of, you know, trying to drown out those feelings by drinking. And I was trying to get away from the feeling of, of you know, committing suicide. You know, and, and, and the feeling of depression and anxiety and knowing that I have uh, multiple charges over my head that I need to deal with based on, all at the same time, based on something that I didn't do. And not one person listened to me or cared to listen to me. You know, I, I was by myself, essentially, and that, I mean, I had support from my friends, but I never had one ounce of support from the service. Instead, I had Richard Hedges hanging me out to dry type deal. You know, going after, I knew it, his whole goal wasn't to rehabilitate me or help me or, you know, mold me into a better officer. His whole goal was, how can I fire this guy? I, uh, any chance he got to lay a charge on me, he laid a charge on me. Never once, even after I went up to him crying in the lobby of headquarters, um, explaining how hard this was on me, never once did he ever offer me any help. He just made everything harder. And he single-handedly traumatized my career in the sense that I don't know if I could ever go back. He single-handedly almost drove me to suicide.